Oh, so you have really come. Welcome to my home, human. Where am I? Oh, sorry. It's true. Follow the path surrounded by sunflowers. You can't miss it. How are you able to hear me so clearly, even if I'm not there with you? Well, it's a bit complicated. I will explain everything to you when you have reached me. Anyways, why have you chosen to accept this job? I never thought that anyone would have even seen it, to be truly honest. I am so excited to work with you. My name is Primula. Yours? Oh, it's a beautiful name. But what is that second word that you have said after it? Uh, a surname? What is it? What do you mean by that? I am not joking, and... Oh, hi. No, no, no. Please, don't run away. I have told you that I would have explained everything to you. Haven't I? Please, please, please. I am a dryad. A monster girl. That's how humans call my race. As you can see, I am half inside this tree. But don't worry, I am not hurt in any way nor in pain. I've been born from this tree. I am not sure why, but this is where I've started to live. I am no harmful monster. I am literally just a plant. Look, I have flowers branches, and, and, you, you weren't scared, but just out of breath by my beauty, <laughs> you are way too kind, of course, you can curse my flowers, that's one of the reasons why I made that job offer. Mm, you see, I've been taking care of this greenhouse for years, but there are now way too many plants and flowers to take care of everything by myself. And thus, why I've been looking for someone to help me with the care of this garden. Many fruits and flowers that grows here are the last of their species and thus the need for someone to help me. To repay you, I will let you take all the fruit, vegetables and flowers that you want. That's what I can offer and... Oh, alright. How have I been able to post a job offer if I'm stuck here? Well, I can control the plants around me and by doing so, I've managed to obtain a, a laptop. I've used some vines to do it, so I had a bad view on what I was doing. I have also used the roses to talk with you before and... <sighs> no... You can keep on patting my head. It's relaxing. You... You will stay here and help me? Oh... <laughs> Thank you. Oh, so you are an actual gardener? I couldn't hope for anyone better than that, then. Uh, a tulip? Oh, right. 
But that's the flower on my scalp. Mm. You are so gentle with your hands. <laughs> and no, no, I, I am not crying. It's, it's just, I have never seen anyone that would run away after just seeing me. And, and this is the first time I, I get touched. with yellow fruits about 20 logs from the entrance of the greenhouse. I couldn't manage to cut the exceeding branches with only the vines, so may you go and cut them, please? You can ask me any question, even from afar. I will hear you from the other plants. Oh, you're right. I should stop hugging you. <sighs> Sorry. The bushes with the yellow fruits are called... Oh, so you already know that? I see. Lucky for me then, I guess. Knowing that you are experienced with plants makes me feel even more relaxed. Even if not as relaxed as when he is hugging me, I felt so protected and safe, like he would never harm me, ever. He is a very stunning man too, and that's nearly impossible. At least as far as the boogie told me last week, she was able to find one and only because he was crying and screaming while in bed. She needed to bumper him so much to even just have him stop crying. But, but that's not the case here. He seems so strong and brave. No way I could ever get a chance to... Oh, sorry. I got lost in my thoughts. Oh, it seems that you have already finished. And you have done such a great job too. This place is gonna become beautiful. Filled with flowers and any kind and... Wh what do you mean by that? There is already a flower that makes the place perfect? It, it is not the blooming season so... The first of the flowers will come out and... Oh, uh, hello there. I didn't think you would come back so quickly, so as I was saying a few moments ago, flowers still have to... You... You meant me? But... I am not a flower, it's just, uh, oh, 
it was just a game of words. What you meant is that I am beautiful. I, I, I have never been. Oh, please stop. Stop saying that. I am just a monster stuck in a tree. I am not beautiful. I... I don't know what to... to... Please... Kiss me... more... Your lips feel so warm on mine. Can can you stay here with me, please? Despite having always stayed here, I get all scared and trembling. Could you please stay here with me all day long? You can bring here everything you need. I won't mind. No one comes in this building. No one ever did. You can take some place in one or some of the rooms and make yourself at home. I only ask for you to... <sighs> Mm. Mm. I... No. I can't. I literally can't. Look at my lower torso. Half of my legs are still embedded in this wood and there is no way for me to... to... Mm. Mm. What? What do you mean? There is a way to let me get out of this tree? I have never heard of something able to do that. What is it? just that your hands feel so good on my chest but I still don't understand what you have in mind why why have you stopped a, a question of course ask away if if I will Marry you? What does that mean? I've never heard that word. You... You are asking me to take care of this greenhouse? You... Want to make love with... With me? Of course. I will. We will take care of this greenhouse together. It will be the most perfect in the entire world. Mm. But uh, still, how am I supposed to get out of this tree? Oh, just by becoming an adult? What does it mean? Mm. I need nutrients to grow that bit more. Oh, what kind of nutrients? So, the ones from my species would 
become able to detach from their trees after having reached maturity, but... But you think that I need a quick push? What do you mean? Oh, my... My chest... Your hands... Your hands are getting so close to... To... Oh, you will make love with me? Of course, I want to do it. Just please. Please be gentle. Soft kitty 